Hello, YouTube. Skid and Mirror. Welcome back to the Minecraft video. Today we have the monostable circuit, or a pulse shortener, as it is in layman terms. So this is it. This is all you have to do. I'm not going to do a full like tutorial video. Just look at the screen right now, and this is how you build it. It's very simple. Uh, this is a sticky piston right there. Now, um, just to show you how this works, this is a pulse shortener. So if we have an input on this side, and we can do whatever we want, we can have a button or a lever, and if we put something over here, so let's say we put like a block on top of that. Press the button and you can see it's one tick and you press the button again and you can see it's one tick and you'll see this thing flash um, very fast. So the whatever the output is um, or the input is, the output is always going to be one tick. You see if we leave it on, it's one tick. If we do it fast, it's one tick. Um, whatever you do, the output is going to be one tick. Now this output can be changed depending on which you put this at, so if we do it like a lot, you can see that's the output, that's how many ticks the output is. So you can change the output um, length uh, to vary based on your input. So you can change that to whatever you want. So there you go, that is your monostable circuit or pulse shortener. Very simple to build, very simple to add. Just put your input on this side, output on this side, and you have it. If you like this video, uh, please like the video. You know, it helps. And if you loved it, then make sure to subscribe. But this has been Skatem, and I will see you in the next video.